This is the story of Tamara Patty, a vibrant 43-year-old single mother and successful businesswoman whose life was tragically cut short. Tamara had built a fulfilling life for herself and her two young daughters, but her estranged husband Aubrey Puel Patty's escalating abuse and control would ultimately lead to her brutal murder in her own home. As the investigation unfolded, a chilling tale emerged, one of domestic violence, shattered trust, and a family's unimaginable grief. Welcome to Crime Corner. Subscribe and hit the bell icon for more stories. This story takes us to Staleybridge, Greater Manchester, a quaint town known for its close-knit community and picturesque landscapes. In this peaceful town, a devastating tragedy unfolded, leaving a deep impact on all who knew the victim. Tamara Patty was a 43-year-old woman who resided in Staleybridge with her two daughters. She was a devoted mother, cherished friend, and respected member of the community. Tamara's warm and caring nature endeared her to everyone she met, and she was beloved by all who knew her. Tamara worked as a dedicated caregiver, providing essential support and assistance to those in need. Her commitment to her job was evident in the compassion and empathy she showed towards her clients, making a positive difference in their lives each day. As a mother, Tamara was deeply devoted to her two daughters, 15-year-old Tia and 10-year-old Mia. She prioritized their well-being and happiness above all else, and her love for them knew no bounds. Tamara's daughters were her pride and joy, and she worked tirelessly to provide them with a loving and nurturing environment. In addition to her roles as a mother and caregiver, Tamara was known for her vibrant personality and infectious laughter. She had a zest for life and a generous spirit that touched the hearts of those around her. Tamara's friends and colleagues described her as a beacon of positivity, always ready to lend a helping hand and brighten someone's day with her infectious smile. Despite facing challenges in her personal life, Tamara remained resilient and determined to create a better future for herself and her daughters. Her unwavering strength and courage inspired those around her, leaving a lasting legacy of love and kindness in the hearts of all who knew her. In Tamara Patty's life, there was a significant figure whose presence would ultimately lead to tragedy, 41-year-old Aubrey Patty, her estranged husband. Tamara and Aubrey had been married for 14 years before their relationship began to unravel, leading to their eventual separation. Their relationship had once been filled with love and companionship, but over time, cracks began to appear. Reports suggest that Aubrey's behavior became increasingly controlling and abusive, causing Tamara to feel uneasy and unsafe in her own home. Despite their history together, Tamara made the brave decision to end the marriage and pursue a new life for herself and her daughters. Tamara Patty and Aubrey Puel Patty had established Greenleaf Health and Social Care Limited together. The company is described as a leading provider of experienced care and support staff to the health and social care sector. Despite their separation, Tamara and Aubrey remained connected through their shared business. Tragically, Aubrey's escalating controlling and abusive behavior towards his wife caused Tamara to fear for her safety. Sadly, her efforts to break free from the cycle of abuse ultimately ended in tragedy. In the early hours of July 7, 2023, a tragic and heinous crime unfolded at a residence in Staleybridge, Greater Manchester, United Kingdom, involving Tamara Patty, a successful and beautiful single mother of two daughters. On that fateful night, Tamara returned home around 1.30 a.m. along with a co-worker after finishing a night care visit. She suggested that her co-worker could sleep over for a few hours, and they both retired to bed. Tamara's co-worker slept on the first floor, while Tamara went to her bedroom on the second floor. Tragically, during the night, Tamara was viciously attacked by her estranged husband, Aubrey Patty, aged 46. Aubrey had concealed himself in the house armed with knives, a hammer, gloves, and a length of cord, and launched a brutal assault on Tamara as she slept. The attack left Tamara with severe injuries, including multiple stab wounds. 
Tamara's co-worker, who was asleep on the first floor, woke up to the sounds of the assault and immediately called the authorities for help. They provided crucial information to the police, indicating that Aubrey Patty was responsible for the attack. Despite the co-worker's distress call, Aubrey managed to flee the scene before the authorities arrived. After the assault, Tamara was rushed to the hospital, but her injuries were too severe, and she was pronounced dead shortly after arriving. The investigation into the crime revealed the disturbing details of Aubrey's actions leading up to the assault. Despite their separation, Aubrey had exhibited controlling and abusive behavior towards Tamara. Just the day before the attack, Aubrey had hit Tamara in the face after she refused to give him her phone. He had also sent threatening messages to her, indicating his volatile state of mind. Aubrey's guilt was undeniable, and a few days after the assault, he was apprehended by the authorities and charged with the murder of his wife, Tamara Patty. Aubrey entered a guilty plea in court, admitting to the brutal assault and murder. The court proceedings shed light on the abusive dynamics of their relationship and the tragic consequences it had led to. Aubrey Patty, the perpetrator of this heinous crime, confessed to the assault on his wife but shockingly justified his actions by stating that she deserved it. This callous admission revealed the depths of his depravity and disregard for human life. Prior to this brutal murder, Aubrey Patty had exhibited troubling behavior, including assaulting Tamara on a previous occasion by punching her in the face when she refused to let him use her phone. Additionally, he had been discovered secretly listening to her phone voicemails, further indicating a pattern of controlling and abusive behavior. Neighbors were also shocked and horrified by the tragic events that unfolded in their community. They described Tamara as a lovely woman who had only recently moved to the area but had already made a positive impression with her friendly demeanor. The sudden violence that claimed her life left them shaken and saddened. Tamara's family remembered her as a vibrant and successful single mother who cherished her two daughters deeply. Despite the challenges she faced, Tamara remained dedicated to providing for her family and pursuing her career aspirations. Her daughters, Tia and Mia, expressed their devastation at losing not only their mother but also their best friend. Their heartfelt tributes spoke to the profound impact Tamara had on their lives and the void left by her absence. The tragic fate that befell Tamara Patty should never have occurred. Her life was cut short by the senseless violence inflicted upon her by her estranged husband, Aubrey Puel Patty. The loss of such a vibrant and beloved member of the community leaves a profound void that can never be filled. Tamara's murder serves as a reminder of the devastating consequences of domestic abuse and the urgent need for intervention and support for victims. Despite Tamara's efforts to break free from the cycle of abuse, the relentless control and violence perpetrated by Aubrey tragically ended in her untimely death. In hindsight, there were likely signs of Aubrey's abusive behavior that went unnoticed or unaddressed. Early intervention and support systems for victims of domestic violence could have provided Tamara with the resources and assistance she needed to escape the escalating danger she faced. Community awareness and education on recognizing the signs of abuse and knowing how to seek help could have made a difference in Tamara's life. The impact of Tamara's tragic death reverberates far beyond her immediate family. Her daughters, Tia and Mia, are left to navigate a world forever altered by the loss of their beloved mother. The trauma of witnessing their mother's murder and grappling with the aftermath will leave scars that may never fully heal. Friends, colleagues, and neighbors are left mourning the loss of a cherished friend and community member, grappling with the senselessness of her death. Thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next episode.